time ago, Body of Portia Williams, they're getting a divorce, okay? It's getting messy. He was hanging out with Body by J. Body by J is thirsty, 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 thirsty. I guess her story about, you know, the botched booty wasn't enough. And so she had to go ahead and play with a married man. Allegedly, allegedly, allegedly. Okay. And then in Body by J's live, they're calling her Mrs. Guabadia. They're calling her, hey, Mrs. Guabadia in Body by J's um, live. So I find that to be really interesting. Now we jump to today. Simon is hanging out with his Ethiopian sis. His Habasha. His Habasha says Ethiopian Highland Semitic speaking Orthodox Christians. That's what Google says. Okay. That's what Google says. So he's hanging out with his Habasha sis. Okay. Now Simon in the comments pinned a comment and it said, Y'all are so dumb. Something to that effect. They've been friends since y'all even knew who Simon was. Okay, that may be true. That may be true. Maybe this and uh, 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 this man, Simon, and this lady by the name of Yasmin, maybe they've been friends before we even knew who Simon was. But Simon did not post Yasmin until today. Okay, so sure, they could have been friends for years. But why is this the first time we seeing Simon and Yasmin hanging out and then posted up onto the Instagrams? This is my first time seeing Yasmin. Yasmin, who are you? And why does Simon feel the need to hang out with you? And why do Simon and Yasmin feel the need to hang out with Lanithia Lakes? Why are they hanging out? Okay, hold on, you guys. Let's look at this. Ooh. Let's look at this. Look at these pictures. This was posted today. This is Yoni Man uh nini's on and off again boyfriend right who's best friends with simon gobadia who's married to portia williams we know they're going through a divorce and this is a oh who is that in the middle his ethiopian sis who he's been friends with for years now in the middle hanging out with them we went from body by jay to this beautiful woman she's a gorgeous woman simon has a, a, a a type he likes really super gorgeous women but how petty of Nini. Nini said, oh, you're going to try to stop my bags knowing that I'm already blackballed. Okay, sis, I got you. Checkmate. And so she publicly embarrassed Portia Williams by talking about that story regarding the Upshaws, which, oh, my God, I had no clue that the Upshaws was that popular. Okay, so me. So me, so me. Everybody was like, you need to watch it before you talk about it. And it's actually a gush. <laughs> Mike Epson, Kim Fields, and yeah, yeah. I'm like, okay, my bad. Don't burn me at the stake. Don't uh, 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 nail me to the cross, chair. Maybe I need to check out Upshaws. I probably won't. I'm not a, a sitcom girly, but geez, Louise. But listen, listen, you guys. Not only did she expose the story about Portia kind of like putting a stain on her name, saying that they have issues, and that's the reason why she doesn't want to do the guest appearance on the Upshaws, but now Lanithia Leakes and Yoni Man is hanging out with Simon Gabadia in his Habesha sis. Am I saying that right? I mean no disrespect. Okay. Um, this is really interesting. It's getting very petty. Rodney the voice, I think he's a YouTuber. Is he not? Somebody fact check me in the comments down below. He uh wrote under the shade room comments, Portia tried to stop Nini's bag. Nini owes Portia nothing but an ass whooping. Next case. Nini responded and said, Say it loud so the people in the back can hear. This is getting really petty. I want to talk about Kenya next, but we'll do that in a separate video. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, and don't forget to create a great day. Bye.